You may not know his face, but you know his talent. He's the North Texan behind hits like Leanne Rhymes Blue. Tiffany Liu looks at the legacy of Bill Mack, the Midnight Cowboy. It's Bill Mack Showtime. Some people are born with talent. Here's your Grammy winning member of the Country Music Disc Jockey Hall of Fame. If you ask Bill any of his friends. Mack. Magical is exactly the word. Bill Mack was one of them. He was a legend. He really was. His son posted Friday. My dad passed away early this morning due to COVID-19 with underlying conditions. This North Texas man was a country music singer-songwriter. He won a Grammy Award in 1996 for writing Blue, one of Leanne Rimes' biggest hits. Why can't you be blue? Mac even wrote Drinking Champagne, sang by multiple artists, including George Strait. No this guy personally knew so many people and gave them their start. But beyond his achievements as a musician, he was the booming voice through the radio. I hope everybody's feeling real fine. Those long cross-country drives. Bill Mack kept people company on the roads and in their homes. Bill, in, in his mercy, uh, said to me one night, well, son, why don't you come out and watch my radio show some night? My boy, my boy. He was a mentor to radio personalities like Jody Dean. About 2.30 in the morning, I'd roll out to Broadcast Hill and I'd just watch Bill, I just watch Bill be Bill. He was a friend and longtime colleague at WBAP to Hal J. He'd look at you and go, my boy, my boy, my boy. He was also a husband, a dad, a grandfather, and a great grandfather. He was never too big or too busy to say how you doing. Bill Mack is missed by so many who knew him personally. When no one else would give me the time of day, Bill did. But he is also missed by those he's never met, whose life he kept in tune. And when this show ends, you're gonna say we had a good time with old Bill. In Dallas, I'm Tiffany Liu.